this sensation? What's all that smoky stuff? It gives me the creeps. It's just my asthma. Although it might even kill Mila and me if we linger too long. What? That is one foul fog! This miasma, isn't it only supposed to be produced if soul purification stops? Miasma is expelled as souls pass through the cycle of reincarnation. It's a toxin that eats away at souls. Usually Origin should be keeping it under control. Great, and we're supposed to just hold our noses and charge through it? Beasley already has. By using L's power, no doubt. <laughs> I see you noticed. What we are seeing here is not real. <laughs> A trap by Cronus? Yes, he's probably warping the space around us. Creating tricks of light. Illusions to waylay us. It's hard enough to see straight in this fun house, let alone fight. Now what? Muse and I could charge forward and dispel Kronos' power. However... We'd deplete our strength and be useless in the battle to come. If each of the four great spirits could shield one of us, we'd be able to move forward without weakening. Good thinking, but... Right. Only four of us could actually move on. Luger, you decide who goes. The four saying, cats can come along for free. Wow. Ready? I've got to get stronger! I know you can do it!
Stay calm and watch where you're stepping. That's the quickest way through. so dangerous. Satisfied customer. Not yet. I should be helping, not hurting. Just got stronger. I'll keep getting better, bigger and better. A toxin that erodes souls, the byproduct of human greed. another step. That's why I have to conquer my fear. I got him. 
That's a wrap. What are you writing? I'm just jotting some notes in my L diary. L diary? I'm keeping track of what happens while L's away. So when we see her, we won't have forgotten anything. So it's like a souvenir for L? Maybe I should get her something too. A collection of pretty stones, maybe. You'll have to prepare her favorite meal, Luga. Yeah. And you can put on a cloak and golden crown for her, Gaius. A cloak and crown? I'm sure that's how L likes to see her kings. What about me? When we get to Canaan, you'll show her what it is you do. That is what you promised her, is it not? Yes. Yes, it is. Hey, Tipo. What do you really think of me? You're a god among men! So handsome, so cool, so stylish. Oh my, how did you do that? Your mouth wasn't moving at all. Oh, it's easy enough. I've been waiting for a chance to do that since forever. If you don't mind. But the handsomest of all is that silver fox Rowan. Wow. Impressive. It was just like he was talking. <laughs> you honor me. I want to try. Oh, I'm so hungry. Let's eat soon. Mila, that was amazing. Is there anything the Lord of Spirits can't do? It pains me to say it, but I think you have all of us beaten. Really? Thanks. I've never tried that before, but it's quite entertaining. I bet with a little bit of practice... That's enough! Stop treating people like a ventriloquist dummy! My body is not your plaything! Plaything, you say? Why, that gives me all sorts of interesting ideas. Uh, like what? Her eyes are scaring me! Or for worse, this is really the end. Let's go claim our destiny.
Looks like I cut it pretty close. You did well to make it this far. Only took 2,000 years. Who is the girl? One look at her face should tell you. She's a victim of your twisted little game. Origin was only trying to provide humanity with the opportunity to grow, to evolve. By ordering us to solve a puzzle and then hiding all the pieces? He gave you the key. The rest was up to you. Right, and here I am. Ah, but you have not opened the door yet, have you? If your young companion were to become a catalyst, humanity would fail the trial. <laughs> I've grown tired of this game. Impressive for a human. Like I care what you think, spirit. The key of Kresnik. Is this your trump card? Perhaps. I suppose you thought you could win if you both attacked at once. A futile plan, as you can see. She's sealed away. She'll have privacy to complete her transformation into a Divergence Catalyst. You monster! You dare judge me? You who force Origin to dispose of the miasma produced by your souls? Origin granted humanity the chance to evolve and grow despite the toll your soul purification process had on his body. And yet you think nothing of your own toxic impurities, nor do you attempt to raise yourselves from the filth! <laughs> I cannot bear to watch my friend's torment any longer. I'll put a stop to all this and save him! But that'll pop the cork on the miasma, right? Well, guess what? I'm not okay with that. You will feel no discomfort. In fact, once your soul is consumed, you will feel nothing at all. The miasma will consume all human souls, reducing them to nothing more than inanimate objects for producing mana. <laughs> Afterwards, I will simply seal away the miasma. Then spirits will finally have the world to themselves. <coughs> Interesting. <coughs> you killed your own brother. To boost your strength? <coughs> Never! I fight for the every man, every time, and win. I will never allow it! I'll fight you on behalf of all the beautiful girls out there! Right! You got this! 
For the every man, every time. I will never allow it. I'll fight you on behalf of all the beautiful girls out there. Right. Energy shackle. Energy shackle. Recharge. Energy shackle. Judgment.
I shall deliver your judgment. Form your foyer! As if. Hedrick! You cannot lose. Not like this. You did it, Luger! Friendship triumphs again! <laughs> now I have the strength to protect. Man, I feel good. I'll keep getting better. Bigger and better. <sighs> I won't accept this. You will not inflict agony upon Origin any longer! You are a poor sport, Kronos. Don't bother. Your mastery of time and space is useless against the power of Origin's Void. That means the girl is... Correct. The true key of Kresnik. This cannot be... Trial's over. Humanity wins! <laughs> What are you doing here? <sighs> How could you put her through this? I did what was needed to defeat Kronos. At the very least, this tragedy will not be in vain. With my wish, I shall rob the spirits of their will, creating a world solely for humans. <sighs> the spirit Origin would never grant a wish like that. Origin has no say in the matter. Oh! The trial itself is a spirit mark, spawned from the pact between the progenitor Kresnik and the great spirit Origin. As long as the pack's conditions are met, Origin will be compelled to use his power. <laughs> Give it up. She's beyond saving now. Of course, you could always wish away her name. No! We have to get rid of the fractured dimensions! Ah, yes. And Origin can grant only one wish from one person at a time. I suppose one way to save her would be for me or Luger to turn into a catalyst before she does. That would be the millionth catalyst, the magic number, and all transformations in progress would be cancelled. <laughs> of course, that also means humanity fails the trial, and the world comes to a bitter end. Please, push away the fractured dimension, so that Luger won't disappear. This through, Luger. Your real daughter will be born in the world someday. He's right. I'm just... a phony. Luger! Alone. 
I gotta say, this doesn't seem like a fair fight. Then join me. Thanks, but no thanks. I am gonna stick with these guys. Hm. You are all nothing more than the spirit's lapdogs. I've crawled over a mountain of corpses to get this far! Just wonderful. Oh, he looks tough! But we're not scared! Luger. Don't waste my time. Luger, remember, we're here to help. You'll be a tough one to crash. Leave the healing to me! Julius's soul to build the bridge. <coughs> you really killed Glasses Guy? With one poor decision, you instantly made everyone's death meaningless. Your brother's death. Your own death. <coughs> Daddy! 
Luigi's pocket watch. Luger! Even her death. <laughs> Heads up! I 
wouldn't use the chromatis again if I were you. When you make a direct pact like that, you then run the risk of degenerating and becoming a divergence catalyst yourself. Considering the sheer power at your disposal, you would transform in the blink of an eye. <laughs> Well, I never expected that you would surpass me. But that is exactly what makes humans so interesting! We never do what's expected. You want my wish, Origin? Let me tell you my own personal wish. To take this fist, and punch you all to oblivion! Beasley Bacor, may your soul rest in peace. A man who gave his life to fulfill his duty. There is nothing to fear. If it comes to it, I'll handle things. Yeah. The Great Spirit Origin. The one and only. I am very pleased to meet you, King Gaius. You know about me. Of course I do. You see, the souls tell me everything. They're sort of like my little birds. You seem quite curious about humans. Perhaps, but not as much as you, Maxwell. I suppose this is our first meeting, but we have little time for pleasantries. We have a request. To rid the fractured dimensions and continue soul purification. Precisely. I would be willing to help you if you think you're at your limit. Even if that meant endless torment? Even so. You really do love humans, don't you? Mila, wait! Enough! You would force Origin to continue the purification? I refuse to stand idly by as you continue to torment him with your corruption! Thank you, Kronos. Your concern for me has consumed you for far too long. You mustn't burden yourself over me. 
We must make the humans accountable and have them pay for their crimes. <laughs> What's so funny? Well, you just showed the most human thing about you. It reminds me why I love humans. What? I hereby grant these representatives of humanity the right to make one wish. Luger and L, for overcoming the trial and opening the door, the wish is yours. Me and Luger? Yes, wish for anything, but you must decide together. I could even undo your transformation into a catalyst. <laughs> You can't do that. We have to wish away the fractured dimensions. I suppose one way to save her would be for me or Luger to turn into a catalyst before she does. That would be the millionth catalyst, the magic number, and all transformations in progress would be cancelled. So then, what shall it be? You do not wish for Elle's safety? What? Wait, you can't be serious! By turning into a catalyst first? No! Stop! You can't do this! Very well then. Will that be your final decision, Luger Kresnik? Wait, Luger, you can't do this! Jude, let him be. Luger, you're not afraid of vanishing away? Understand. Then I will accept your wish. Are you okay with this? You're doing what most wouldn't dare. For that, I commend you. Understand, El? You're the one that Luger chose. Not one of the possible Els. Not even himself. He chose you, here and now. This is humanity's true nature, isn't it? Yes, they truly are capable of anything their hearts desire. Even profoundly foolish things. You may be right, but the impurity that exists within their souls is precisely what gives them strength. Come again? What do you think the impurity is? I don't know. Greed, maybe? Desire? Our ego? Yes and no. Is desire different from dreams? Isn't ego the same as free will when viewed in a positive light? In other words, neither is good or evil. Yes, precisely. And that is the reason why I haven't been eliminating it. I remove the miasma created during reincarnation and seal it. But if you do that, the production of miasma will never end. That's why I wanted to test humanity's decision. To see if humans could strive for perfection while bearing the impurity. Humanity's decision. 
Precisely. That is what I truly wanted to know. But you must continue to show me. Of course. We too will prove who we are. Just as Luger, El, and Julius did. That is a test harsher than anything I could throw at you. If you can overcome it, I have no choice but to concede. For the time being, we shall seal away the miasma, together. Kronos. But, if humanity should once again- Don't worry. No matter how many millennia it takes, we will succeed. Some very special humans have turned me into a believer. Hm. Then I expect to be impressed. I appreciate it, Kronos. No need for thanks. I'll give you a piece of my mind later. We have plenty of time for that. It's time I grant Luger's wish. The elimination of all fractured dimensions. Luger, it's been an honor knowing you. I will never forget what you have done here today. You wrap things up almost too perfectly. You're just jealous, because you know you couldn't have pulled it off. Luger, you need not worry about Elle. We'll take good care of her. We promise! You have helped me to fulfill my duty once again. Luger Kresnik. You have my thanks. And I promise too, I won't lie anymore. And I'll even eat my tomatoes. I'll never forget how you saved me. And just how good your cooking was. Okay? Okay? This should restore the cycle of reincarnation to normal. Yes. Now the human and spirit realms will live on. And we will make sure of that. Farewell, humans and spirits. Let us hope for a brighter day the next time we meet.
you for everything.
Everyone's moving up in the world. Editor Rolando. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, Alvin. Mm -hmm. I can talk. <laughs> no, I'm not taller than you yet, but I'm starting to catch up. Let me guess. You're calling about a job, right? Yeah. Uh huh. Got it. Elise will be joining us this time. Thank you. 